Grafenko. So I had to be like, okay, if you came into my restaurant and you were surprised that it was delicious, it was one thing, right? But when you're expecting it to be delicious because you have an award, it's a different thing. So is it best female chef of Asia delicious? Then we had to, you know, redefine what that meant. So, so I was actually quite hesitant to take that award because I was like, okay, I just turned 32 and I just had five years restaurant experience and just opened a restaurant. And then, then we were like, okay, if I take it, what good can we do? I just wanted to live very publicly in terms of whether it was my struggles or the positivity or whatever it was I could share that I thought could influence the younger generation to take a chance. Because my thing was like, I'm not even that special. If I can do it, I'm pretty sure a lot of kids can figure it out how to you know, do it as well.